Only on CBS 42 News tonight, an Alabama man has connected with his long lost brother of nearly 70 years. Tonight, they met for the very first time. CBS 42 News reporter Jake Chapman has this story that is sure to tug on your heartstrings when you see this long awaited reunion. Nervous is one way to describe how 81 year old John Saffa of Center, Alabama felt when he discovered he had a baby brother. I never thought. That this was ever going to happen. John's mother gave him away when he was young, so he never knew if he had any siblings or other relatives. His daughter, Jonna, suggested taking a DNA test to see if he had any family out there. And what they discovered would change everything. You got seven nephews, you got a niece, and you got a brother. And I said, I got a brother. His 71 year old brother, Tom Moore, lives in Arizona. They connected with each other online in December. No, they started having conversations dad. daily. But due to John's health, well, he couldn't fly out to meet Tom and his family. So Moore decided to come out and see him. Once I booked the ticket, I knew I was coming, and I knew we were going to see each other in person. Hey, brother. <laughs> <laughs> It's so good to see you. Yeah, good to see you too. <laughs> they say most family connections take time to form, but they seem to have hit it off immediately when they shared their love for baseball, though they don't necessarily agree with who to cheer for. Now, he's an Arizona fan. Of course, I'm a Braves fan. <laughs> I don't hold that again. <laughs> but that doesn't change how he feels about his baby brother. No, I got a brother. And I just, he knows I love him. And I know he loves me. And it's a connection they will cherish forever. I'm going to be in touch with him until he gets tired of it. <laughs> you don't run into a story like that often, do you? No. In Center, Alabama. You look, well, I see your eyes and your nose looks just like mom. <laughs> I mean, you look just like her. Jake Chapman, CBS 42 News. Local coverage you can count on.